Oh, hello guys, welcome back to the channel. In this video, we'll cover this amazing lab. First of all, click on Start Lab and open the console and cognito window. Now, here, if you are new to this channel, do like the video and subscribe the channel. Here, just click on I understand and just click on Agree and Continue if you are getting any kind of pop up. Now, just stay tuned. Here, basically, we have to just open the VM instance and activate the Cloud Shell and create an API key and just test the API key. Let me show you how you have to do. First of all, click on I agree and then click on Agree and Continue. Now, from here, you can see on the search box you have to just first of all come to task number one here you can see these are the tasks which we have to perform back again to the console page first thing is that you can see here come over here from the search box just select this compute engine and from here just click on this credentials on open in a new tab let me show you how you have to do first of all come over here and just click on this credential right click open in a new tab now wait for this page to open now from here click on the vm instance one thing first of all activate the cloud shell click on the button next to the gemini icon click on continue and then just authorize yourself okay just authorize yourself and after that what you need to do if you are seeing this kind of error do not worry click on it click on authorize and again from the search box open the vm instance like this just open the vm instance compute engine and the vm instance here just click on the vm instance option and if you get any kind of random pop-up just close it now you can, here you can see the down arrow you have to just click on it okay just click on the down arrow first of all here you can see the project id is not set so just drag your mouse cursor till here and paste it and use the right arrow key use the right arrow key and paste the project id from the lab instruction and if you are already seeing this yellow project id then you can proceed for the next task now come over here and here you can see ssh option you have to just click on this down arrow vog cloud command run in the cloud shell and hit enter now here you have to just type y and hit enter twice let me increase the font size type y and hit enter twice again hit enter and just follow as i am doing now if you get any kind of error just repeat the same procedure here now we have to just export the api key so for that come over here to the credentials page okay first of all open any notepad now click on credentials create credentials and then api key create now once the api key is ready we will just export it so here the api key is now ready come over here and come to here and then from the lab instruction paste it over here now replace the export api key value select all paste over here like this now come over here and create the request.json file just run it like this and after that you can see here we have to run the nano command and adjust paste the file over here just Control v and to exit Control x y and then hit enter now just check the score for this particular task and now just call the speech to text api run this one and run the another curl command so once you run this you can see we are done with the lab guys do like the video and subscribe the channel if you want to enable this check my progress bar you can check the video description i've shared how to enable this check my progress so that's all about this video thank you have a great day